Hi, hello, and welcome to Nine Know It All. I'm your host, Aniza Jackson. My guest today is Sean Dare, Dare Gordon. Today, we're going to be talking about why NIL is a key factor for athletes. So, Sean, tell me why you think this is a key factor for athletes today. I think NIL is really important for athletes today because it allows them to make money while in college. It allows them to be able to support themselves, you know, while also focusing on their academics. Um, I also feel like it's a good thing for athletes because they're able to market themselves. They're able to be able to capitalize off of the value they bring to their sports and their team. So I feel like that's really important for them. I could see that, but I just think having to deal with the marketing and doing, dealing with academics as well as the sport, it's just a lot of time management going on. I definitely agree with that. You know, definitely time management is important in college. But then I'm just looking at, you know, the revenue a lot of these schools bring in, especially for a lot of these top um, athletes. You know, there's a lot of fans at these games that come for specific players. Mm -hmm. And I just feel like it's fair for them to be able to make some type of money um, rather than kind of just going with the scholarship. Not saying that the scholarship is not enough, but some kids, you know, that come from backgrounds where, you know, they struggled growing up, this could be a good opportunity for them to kind of, you know, make some money and be able to support their family. Mm -hmm. um, although me, it might be a, a good, but it also might be overwhelming for these athletes to having to prioritize their studies and athletic performance. Definitely, definitely. Um, and that's why, again, you know, time, time management in college is really important. Having to be able to balance, you know, academics, you know, the school load with their sport is obviously going to be a little bit stressful. But I feel like there's ways to kind of minimize, like, I guess, the weight of carrying both. I feel like there's ways to work around it where they maybe can find the right ske uh, scheduling to be able to play their sport and make money while not having to devote too much time, you know, on the business side of that. Um, I also think some athletes might get an NIL deal, but it'll be better than the other teammates that they have. So I think some teammates won't like that. Definitely. Um, that could definitely, you know, cause some conflict. But at the end of the day, you know, depends. <laughs> well, that will do it for now. I know it all. Thank you, Sean. I'm your host, Aniza Jackson. We'll see you next time.